Sorry, Mike. Hello, Mike. You all right? Yeah. Look at that. Hey guys, your boy Big Japa. What's up? How you doing? <laughs> Beautiful. Just gonna cross the road. Let's check that out. I'm just walking home now and uh, my home is around this area somewhere yeah no far away from the Gunners no far away from the Emirates Stadium as you can see I just walked a few minutes and I was there I'm actually gonna go in the park for a bit and I'll chill out. Yeah. So here I am at Finsbury uh, Park and Blackstock Road is there and that's uh, where normally during March day a lot of people walk there, you know, all the way. You walk straight that road over there uh, you get to Emirates Stadium as well yeah yeah I just been to the uh, Emirates Stadium and um, going home instead of uh, taking the train again I decided to walk uh, because there's a nice you know sort of quiet pathway, quiet road uh, that can take me where I need to go so just uh, 
take a stroll and uh, enjoy the uh, beauty it's a beautiful sunny day lovely lovely sunny day in London and uh, yeah I thought you know just relax myself and walk I like walking I enjoy walking it's a nice exercise and I uh, get fresh air much needed fresh air which we don't get often in this city so yeah I enjoy walks it's been a quiet place and that's what I'm doing right now that's what I'm doing now so yeah I'm just gonna walk home I walk this road before but you know it uh, haven't been here for a while uh, hopefully it's not blocked or closed somewhere and I'll have to walk back <laughs> that wouldn't be so nice but anyway yeah uh, this road is supposed to get me off to uh, I think Blackstock Road you know and uh, yeah Blackstock Road and then off to the off to uh, the uh, Seven Sisters Road, you know, the main road in a Finsbury Park, which is another beautiful place to relax. I'll probably go in there for a bit just to chill because I have plenty of time. It's about 5 pm now. It's uh, what day is it? It's, it's Friday, it's about 5 pm on a Friday. Uh, today is the 17th, 17th of March. Yeah, 17th of March. Around 6 60. Wow, I'm really happy today. I must have uh, woken up on the good side of the bed. <laughs> super super happy I, I feel really nice and I coming out here really uh, made me even feel nice and the weather is just perfect right now you know like sometimes you wake up and just the weather like determines your mood <laughs> yeah this is uh, one of those countries where we talk about the weather all the time you know it's like you meet a stranger and uh, you don't have anything to talk about just talk about the weather talk about football you know, those are the main things we talk hey, about here. Yeah. talk about weather talk about football just to get conversation going yeah it's like all right, all right. yeah it's a, it's a bit dull today it's very cloudy <laughs> Yeah, so one of the easiest topics to crack a conversation with uh, a stranger. See, when I talk about football, when I was at the stadium, it was so easy. People get so engaged and you can always have a conversation with people talking about football. But yeah, it can be a very emotional and uh, difficult subject if, if you're not careful who you're talking to. Especially if you are from different camps, you support different clubs. Yeah. People who know me, you already know I'm a Chelsea fan, you know. But uh, it's been a horrible year for, for the Blues. It's been a very tough season for us. But. Hopefully we will bounce back next season. You know, with the transition, uh, changing of uh, the owners, Abramovich leaving and getting a new owner, and then lots and lots of players coming in, and uh, yeah, changing managers as well. 
so it had been a season of confusion really at the club but us the faithfuls we we stay strong we know we will bounce back anyway I uh, this year I'm rooting for Arsenal to win simply because you know Man City has been winning it for a long long time and sorry Man City fans and uh, Arsenal they struggled let's face it for years and years and years it would be nice for a big club like this one you know to win something oh look at this really beautiful graffitis wow yeah so this is a route other people walk when they come to to the game uh, if you want to avoid the traffic at the station and you know the main road the other side train station nearby Finchbury Park train station which is a huge one as well you can go various places from here um, Tottenham Football Club is not from here so literally if I go a walk to the end of this road and uh, down to the main road and I take a bus would be less than 20 minutes probably yeah around 20 minutes I've been Tottenham uh, Stadium uh, they, they moved as well recently Tottenham didn't they from White Hat Lane to the magnificent new stadium I haven't been inside the new stadium but I've been to um, the White Hat Lane it's a while since I've been inside the stadium to watch a game but yeah I've been around the, uh, the new Tottenham Stadium it's really really beautiful it's amazing and uh, did you know actually uh, the pitch in Tottenham Stadium there's actually two there's one for football and there's another one underneath uh, the football pitch underneath they, you can just pull it out pull it backwards and then you get the American football pitch because uh, uh, they, they did a contract with them um, the American football so I think they show like two games a year in that stadium yeah, so that's the news for you. I'm sure you didn't know that, did you? <laughs> that's why you should always watch my channel. Yeah. Sorry, mate. Hello, Mike. You all right? Yeah. So, yeah. This is it, guy. I just came up. That little get there. From under the bridge. Under the Finsbury Park Bridge. And uh, here we are in the Facebook Park station. So I'm just gonna chill out in the park for a bit. Uh, if you don't know about this place, one thing to know is uh, full of Algerian immigrants, lots of Algerians in. Uh, Finsbury Park area of London no. so you, you cannot fail to, to meet one if you come here and there's also like plenty of uh, Algerian shops around here and uh, selling Algerian things and you know Islamic things as well 
Yeah, so guys, this is the end of this uh, vlog. Uh, I thought I was gonna walk my way home, but uh, I've decided to just uh, chill a little bit. I'm just gonna hang out in the park. And uh, yeah, so thank you very much for tuning in. If you like this vlog, as always, please subscribe, like the video, and uh, see you in the next one. Bye-bye.